Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here or just stumbling upon this video, hello, my name is Cassie. Um, it's been a minute, but I am back. And if you guys missed my last video, go check that out. I will link it below for you guys as well. But I basically talked about where I've been the last couple months and what's been going on in my life. So if you aren't caught up yet, go watch that video, come back to this one, or just watch this and then watch that one. I don't really care. But anyways, I did a video touching base on everything and where I've been and all my life updates. So now we're here. <laughs> so today is Monday and I'm off on Mondays. So I figured I would vlog a little day in the life today. I'm trying to get some stuff done. We just had family here in town, kind of last minute random. We've got some stuff going on with Steve's family. I won't really touch base on that because that's his side of things. But um, yeah, so we had some family in town and they were staying with us for a couple days. They just left this morning, took them to the airport, hopped in the shower, washed my hair. I just put it back up in a bun for now. Um, and I am staying in some cozy clothes today because I am gonna keep my butt home and working on stuff here. So I think the plan is today is I wanna do some cleaning. Um, I've been kind of addicted. Actually, I'm just gonna sit down right here and talk to you guys. I've been kind of addicted with watching cleaning videos on YouTube. It's like so weird, but if you know me, you know I love cleaning. It's like one of my favorite things to do. <laughs> I love watching cleaning videos for some reason. And it's just been inspiring me to clean the house. And since we just had guests here, there's a lot of tidying that needs to happen. I already feel like I'm in the nesting stage, even though I'm only gonna be 20 on weeks. I like already feel like I'm nesting. I'm like, get rid of this, do this, clean this. I wanna get rid of and like clean so many things and organize. I just, I feel like I'm already nesting. So that's that's the, on the agenda today. I am makeup list today. So I hope you guys enjoy this look <laughs> of just being in the PJs and staying home. I'm actually gonna order some lunch just cause we have zero groceries in our house. Um, I just don't know what I wanna order something for delivery cause I don't wanna leave the house either. I hope you guys are excited that I am back. Let me know in the comments if you're new here to my channel um, or if you are an OG watcher and you're just purely excited. <laughs> I know I talked about it a little bit on my Instagram about coming back to YouTube and it, I honestly didn't leave like on purpose or anything. I kind of just took a break because my life was so chaotic. But yeah, now that I'm feeling more like myself again, like a true human, um, I, I'm so happy to be back, you know? If you guys, like I said, if you guys missed my last video, I talked about pregnancy and how hard it hit me and <laughs> everything in between. So go check that out if you guys wanna hear all about that, but. Okay, I decided to place an order from Panera. Let me know what you guys like to order from Panera. Um, I think I'm just gonna, I, okay, this is the part about pregnancy where you get indecisive, okay? So I <laughs> didn't know if I wanted, a sandwich or a salad. I knew I definitely wanted the um, autumn squash soup because that's so good. It's my favorite. And I've actually been craving it a ton this pregnancy. So um, I got that. And I also couldn't decide, obviously, between these two. So I just got the avocado melt and a salad. The Asian sesame salad, that's usually my go-to. And a green tea because it's so good. So I'm going to order that, I think. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys like to order from Panera. I like to hear people's orders and then like try them out sometimes too. So I do that with Starbucks a lot too. I always like to ask people what they like to order from Starbucks and then I like to try it. So yeah, comment below and let me know what your Panera order is. Um, okay, I ordered food, but it's not available for delivery. So I'm gonna have to go pick it up, which is fine. Panera is actually like right around the corner from my house. So I'm gonna go pick it up because it's usually ready in like 10 minutes. But I just realized, I don't think you guys met, officially, on YouTube, met our new boy, our new sweet boy. Yeah. Oh, oh God. Oh. Okay. This is Poey. Well, his name's Poe, but we call him Poey. Or Mr. Sir. Sweet boy. I use the sweetest boy. Okay. <laughs> yes. So Penny has a new brother. And he's so sweet. And I think we've only had him for like six months now. Um, I got him 
when I got off Paranormal Activity, which I can talk about now. Um, so yeah, that movie that I was like living in the middle of nowhere, um, we were shooting Paranormal Activity, like seven or whatever. I don't even remember what number it is, but it's Paranormal Activity, Next of Kin. I talked about it a little bit in my last video. Um, can you guys see inside? I'll be right back, okay? Be right back, I promise. Yeah, that was the movie that I was shooting, that I was doing hair for. Um, so, we got him literally, like, as soon as we wrapped that film, I, I found him, like, I think, like, two days before we wrapped, and then I convinced my husband that we needed him, and we got him, literally right away. <laughs> That's the story of Mr. Sir, which I'm so sorry, you guys, I didn't realize that I didn't share about him because he's our sweet boy, but I probably was crazy for like getting a dog right away after, you know, the work life I have, but now with baby coming, I, and like us preparing to wanting to have a baby, I was like preparing anyways for like not working as much and like settling on, settling on like a safe time to get a dog. So it kind of worked out. It was like perfect timing and He's the perfect boy! And him and Penny honestly look like siblings, so it's kind of funny. You guys, I am so happy to be vlogging again. Like, I honestly think I needed this little break as well. Like, I was so overloaded. I was so overloaded. I was working nonstop, two different movies back to back, which I ended up didn't really fulfilling a full second movie because I got pregnant. Um, yeah, because literally the start of the second film I was on, I got pregnant and I was like, there's no way I can do this for two months. No, I think that movie was three months. It's still a lot with like working in the salon and then movies. It's just, it was crazy. So I honestly needed that break and I just didn't know it. I just feel so re-inspired again and like excited to continue capturing my life with you guys. So and I'm really happy that a lot of you like DM'd me and were like, I'm so happy you're coming back. Mm, 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 mm. Satisfaction. All right, you guys, I just finished my lunch, talked to my mom for a little bit on the phone. And now I'm going to, I think I'm just gonna clean for a little bit right now and just try to tidy up the house. I've been so good at keeping our house pretty maintained. I'm trying to get into this like balance routine where I keep it this way because that way when baby comes, it'll be a little bit easier to work around. Yet again, I know things get nuts when you have kids. So anyways, I think what I'm gonna do is just tidy up the house, get everything in order, start some laundry, wash the guest bedroom sheets and stuff, um, and just get the house back together, put some laundry away, just do all that stuff. Okay, little piece of advice. If you're building a house, redoing a house, anything that involves home improvement, um, my little tip to you is that if you're trying to figure out what color floors to do, although dark floors look insanely beautiful, they also show everything. So just keep that in mind, um, especially if you have dogs and it's muddy season because I wash this floor every single day, okay? vacuum and wash it every day and there's mud always on it so 
just a little piece of device. Dark floors show everything. Keep that in mind. <laughs> I'd probably, next house, definitely lighter floors for sure. Also, if you guys are looking for a really great Christmas idea for someone and are okay with spending a pretty coin on a blanket, this bad boy is a 10 foot blanket and it is so cozy. I will link it for you guys below. Legit, it is 10 feet long. It's huge. I have to wash it at the laundromat, but we love it so much. So this guy lives on our couch. Steve and I share it. It literally is massive but it's amazing phone and sit on Instagram for a minute and I fell asleep. I legit fell asleep. I think only like 30 minutes though. Took a little nap. I guess I needed it but I need to get back to my agenda today. <laughs> it's like a little after four too so that means dinner's coming up soon so don't know how far on the rest of cleaning I'm gonna get but I think I'm just gonna skip the baby's room today and do the rest of like our household stuff get some laundry and stuff put away and then I can focus on the baby's room tomorrow so that is what I'm gonna do I always feel better and like do better when my surroundings are clean and clear it's like a clear mind I love it so anyways that's how I function all right enough bedtime talk <laughs> I'm gonna get up. Does anyone else do this <laughs> when you have like a basket of laundry that you have to put away? My trick is, is I just dump it all in the bed. <laughs> <laughs> cleaned up feeling good all I have to do is wash the floors downstairs but I'm kind of like contemplating if I should do it or not because of the dogs and the mud and stuff but I try to do it like every day or every other day just to keep up on it so I might end up doing it but other than that everything's clean our bedroom is cleaned up all the clothes are put away did not bother making the bed because we're gonna go to bed later anyways still my cozy clothes this is literally a total Monday like total Monday for me but um yeah gonna go downstairs hang out for a little bit wash the floors I ordered pizza for dinner <laughs> you guys know I didn't order groceries so I was like pizza it is which Steve is down for pizza all the time so that was easy but yeah I'm gonna go downstairs and hang out got my little bump hanging out with me can you guys believe this I like literally cannot 
cannot. I'll give you guys a little bump date, even though I gave one in my last video, but she's thriving. <laughs> she is thriving. You guys can see like my scars and stuff from my surgery, but oh well, we love it. I don't think that's a, oh, I thought I had stretch marks. I thought that was a stretch mark, but it's just for my pants. Anyways, gonna go chill. Nothing like a shiny clean four. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Yum, 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 yum. This, not so much. I used to love onion rings, but now, like deep fried things like this and french fries, gross me out during pregnancy. I don't know what it is. I mean, I do know what it is. It's fried food, but for some reason pizza sits well. I don't know why.